now let us discuss about xs3 edition uh, here we have uh, two examples uh, let us solve the first example 37 plus 28 uh, xs3 the name itself specifies the meaning we have to add an extra 3 to each and every decimal digit so here the first number is 37 so 37 has two digits such as 3 and 7 so we have to add an extra 3 to each digit so 7 plus 3 means 10 so 10 is nothing but a 3 plus 3 means 6 so this is nothing but xs3 number okay next second number is 28 so add 3 to each and every digit so 3 3 8 plus 3 means 11 so 11 is nothing but b 2 plus 3 means 5 so now these are nothing but xs3 numbers now we need to perform addition operation on these two numbers now let us represent the numbers in binary notation so simply we have to follow 8421 notation so what is the first number 6 6 10 6 10 how to represent 6 in binary notation 0 double 1 0 next how to represent 10 in binary notation 1 0 1 0 so here we have 37 so 37 means we have to add 3 to each and every digit so 3 plus 3 means 6 so 6 in binary notation is 0 double 1 0 next to 7 plus 3 means 10 10 in binary notation is 1 0 1 0 let us take the second number 28 so 28 means 5 11 how to represent 5 in binary notation 0 1 0 1 next 11 11 1 0 1 1 now we need to add these two x xs3 numbers simple uh, simple uh, addition rules only we have to follow 0 plus 1 means 1 1 plus 1 means 0 with a carry 1 0 plus 0 plus 1 means 1 1 plus 1 means 0 with a carry 1 1 plus 1 means 0 with a carry 1 1 plus 1 means 0 with a carry 1 triple 1 means 1 1 0 0 plus 0 plus 1 means 1 uh, here after performing the addition if we get any carry from a particular group then we have to add 3 to the corresponding sum here we have two groups so this is group number 1 this is group number 2 if we get a carry by adding the most significant bits of a group then we have to add 3 to the corresponding sum if we observe here for this group for these four bits what is the most significant bit these uh, these two ones are the most significant bit one plus one means zero with a carry one so by adding the most significance of by adding the most significant bits of the first group we got a carry so that's why we need to add three to the corresponding sum next if we observe the second group 0 plus 0 plus 1 so by adding these three bits we didn't get any carry that means here the carry is 0 so we need to subtract 3 from the corresponding group so here we have two rules what is the first rule if carry is generated by adding the most significant bits of a group add 3 to the corresponding sum second rule if carry is not generated by adding most significant bits of a group uh, then subtract 3 from the corresponding sum now uh, yeah 0 1 0 1 yeah it is sum operation directly we can do that so 1 plus 1 means 0 with a carry 1 next to 0 plus 1 plus 1 means 0 with a carry 1 1 plus 1 means 0 with a carry 1 0 plus 0 plus 1 means 1 so 1 3 bull 0 in binary notation is 8 next here we have to do the subtraction so it is better to do the subtraction by taking the decimal numbers instead of calculating two's complement or taking the borrow from the other digits okay so 1100 in decimal notation is 1100 it is 12 0, 0, 1, 1 in decimal notation is 3 so 12 minus 3 is nothing but 9 so 9 means what is the number 100 9 means 1001 so this is the result okay so this is the result 
after adding these two xs3 numbers 1001100 here after getting the result we can cross verify whether our result is correct or not okay uh, here if we observe this uh, this notation this notation is in xs3 format if we want to get the decimal number then we need to subtract 3 from the corresponding sum why because here the result is in xs3 format why because we have added uh, two uh, xs3 numbers so the result is also in xs3 format in order to get the result in decimal format we need to subtract 3 from it why because xs3 means an extra 3 so we need to subtract 3 from it we need to subtract 3 from it so 9 minus 3 means 6 8 minus 3 means 5 if you observe here 7 plus 8 means 15 3 plus 2 plus 1 means 65 so 37 plus 28 is nothing but 65 only so that is the result now let us solve the second example we have to solve now we have to do xs3 addition operation on 7 and 3 if we add 7 and 3 then the result is 10 then the result is 10 here one more important point is if the input number contains only a single digit then the output number should also contain single digit but if you see this example here we have two inputs 7 and 3 so 7 has only one digit 3 has only one digit then output should also contain only one digit but instead of that here we have two digits let us take 6 and 3 so 6 plus 3 equal to 9 this is in proper format 6 has only one digit 3 has only one digit and the output number also contains only one digit but here the output contains two digits whereas input contains only one digit so in that occasion what we have to do is we have to add an extra zero to the corresponding number so here the input number is 07 plus 03 07 plus 03 so this is nothing but decimal number so now but we have to perform addition on excess three numbers so we need to add 3 to each and every digit so for 0 also we have to add 3 ok so add 3 to it add 3 to it if we add add 3 to it add 3 to it, 3 to it. so 7 plus 3 means 10 that is nothing but a 0 plus 3 means 3 so 3 plus 3 means 6 0 plus 3 means 3 ok so here what is the first number let us uh, yeah these numbers are in excess 3 notation now let us represent in binary notation ok so 3 in binary notation is 0 0 1 1 10 in binary notation is 1 0 1 0 so that is the first number 7 plus 3 so 0 7 so 0 7 means here we have added 3 so 3 means 0 0 1 1 7 means 7 plus 3 means 10 so 10 means 1 0 1 0 next next 3 means second number 0 0 1 0 whereas what is the second digit here 6 so 6 means 0 double 1 0 now let us add these two excess three numbers so 0 0 plus 0 means 0 1 plus 1 means 0 with a carry 1 1 plus 1 means 0 with a carry 1 1 plus 1 means 0 with a carry 1 so triple 1 means 1 1 triple 1 means 1 1 1 0 if we observe the first group this is the first group this is the second group if we observe the first group here we got a carry by adding the most significant bits of this group so what we have to do so simply we have to add 3 to it if we observe the second group here we didn't get any carry by adding the most significant bits so we need to subtract 3 from it we need to subtract 3 from it so 0 plus 1 means 1 1 0 0 next here we have to do the subtraction so it is better to write in decimal numbers and do the subtraction so 0 triple 1 in decimal notation is 7 next 0 double i'm sorry this is not 0 double 1 0 this is 0 0 1 1 this is what 0 0 1 1 0 0 1 1 we need to do the subtraction from the 3 okay so this is 7 this is 3 so 7 minus 3 means 7 minus 3 means 4 so 4 in binary notation is 4 in binary notation is 0 1 double 0 0 1 double 0 so this is the result after uh, adding these two numbers now let's check whether our result is correct or not so in order to get the appropriate decimal number 
what we have to do we have to subtract from 3 here so 0 0 1 1 means it is 3 only so 3 minus 3 is nothing but 0 0 1 double 0 means 4 so 4 minus 3 is nothing but 4 minus 3 is nothing but 1 only so 1 0 so 1 0 is nothing but our decimal uh, number result so with this we can conclude that our two examples are correct so this is about xs3 edition